Hi, you guys. I still miss you. I thought it would be super fun to read you some poetry from this man named Jack Prolutsky. And he wrote a book of poetry called It's Raining Pigs and Noodles. So as you know, it doesn't really rain pigs and noodles. So what do you think you figured out from that? This guy is funny, okay? So he wrote the, pic he wrote the poems and Mr. James Stevenson did all the pictures called illustrations. And I'm gonna read you four little poems from him that just made me laugh out loud. You know how I like to laugh out loud. The first poem is called, The Gummies Are Coming. Now, there are pictures, but they're pretty small. I'll show you the pages at the end of the poem and you can see some of the pictures. The gummies are coming. The gummies are coming. Be worried, beware. They're coming to gum up your fingers and hair. They're coming on scooters, they're coming on skates with gum on their ladles and gum on their plates. The gummies are coming. They're coming in force by bicycle, tricycle, tractor, and horse. Unless you're on guard with an excellent plan, those gummies will gum you as much as they can. The moment they catch you, they'll gum up your clothes, your neck and your shoulders, your ears and your nose. They'll sneak up behind you. They never play fair. The gummies are coming. Be worried, beware. Now here are all the goofy little gummies. You wouldn't like to have them on your clothes or on your neck or running around your body. Yikes. Okay, here's my next poem. You remember how Mrs. Armagnac makes up sometimes um, words for things? Well, this one kind of cracks me up. Remember we talk about blurtitis in my class when kids just blurt out things? This poem is called Pluters, which kind of cracked me up. We are Pluters. We are Pluters. We don't care. We make messes everywhere. We strip forests bare of trees. We dump garbage in the seas. We are Pluters. We enjoy finding beauty to destroy. We intrude where creatures thrive. Soon there's little left alive. Underwater, underground. Nothing safe when we're around. We spew poisons in the air. We are Pluters. We don't care. Yikes. We have pluters and gummies. Oh, I better read something fun. Okay, this is one of my favorite ones. Waffles, give me sniffles. Waffles, give me sniffles. Chicken makes me itch. Toffee gives me toothpaste. Oops, you know how Mrs. Armagnac reads the wrong words sometimes. Let me start again, okay? That's why I love you, my class. Waffles give me sniffles. Waffles give me sniffles. Chicken makes me itch. Toffee gives me toothaches. Tacos make me twitch. Hot dogs give me fever. Ice cream gives me chills. If I nibble candy bars, I'm green around the gills. Pancakes make me queasy. Spaghetti makes me sneeze. As soon as I eat pizza, I get a weird disease. Peanuts give me pimples. Popcorn hurts my throat. One taste of macaroni, my body starts to bloat. Raisins give me rashes. Bananas make me shake. If I bite a burger, I get a bellyache. The moment I try chocolate, I lose a little hair. Broccoli has no effect. That's thoroughly unfair. Let me show you all the things that happen when he eats his 
foods that make him a little crazy. You see that? Do you ever do that when you eat food? Like food you don't like where you get all twitchy and strange? Okay, I'm going to read one more. And I hope it's just as funny. Do we ever see moose up here in Hay Fork? I've never seen a moose, but this is called a group of moose. A group of moose, whose skulls were thick, attempted some arithmetic. Of course, their efforts were no use. Their minds were but the minds of moose. Addition was a hopeless act, and likewise they could not subtract. Devoid of acumen and wit, they could not multiply a bit. Division was beyond them, too. They clearly did not have a clue. Percentages just gave them pains, and fractions overtaxed their brains. Those adulpated moose were vexed, uncomprehending, and very perplexed. We're through with math, they sadly sighed. Those numbers have us mooseified. Do they look mooseified to you? And those are the poems of Jack Prelutsky. I miss you guys very much. Stay inside if it is raining pigs and noodles, okay? Stay in touch with me. Bye.